The masking tools allow you to cut shapes out of your video or images, and can be found up here in the viewer. Click and hold the rectangle mask icon to see all of the shapes available. With a shape selected, click and drag directly in the viewer to draw the mask. Once it's been drawn, you can resize and reposition it with the handles. If you don't see these options, make sure you go back to the selection tool. The freehand mask tool below it lets you draw a custom shape by clicking around the viewer. Click and drag to create a curve. Click the first point to close the mask. The properties for the mask can be found in the controls panel. Here you can adjust the expansion of the mask, the feather, which is how blurry the edges are, as well as the roundness. The invert icon will make the mask do the opposite action. Each mask also has its own transform properties, similar to media on the timeline.